subscribe now so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can create your own flash card okay so you go head over to canva and you type flash card once you type flash card you see couples of flash card different flash cards you select the one you want then you customize it you customize it to change a little bit of it to fit in into what you want so once you've selected the ones you as you can see you have different flashcards once you've selected the one you want you go ahead and you start customizing it okay so you click on where it says customize this template click on it and you start editing it so prevention you don't like what you have there or you want to edit it edit it a little bit so you go ahead and you do that so right now i have one helicopter here and i don't think that is what i want so i'm just going to change that helicopter to something else so i'll remove the picture and um and search for another one that will fit a, into what i want so uh, I can go ahead and also change the number if that is not how I want it or if I don't like the color I can change the color to something else. So let's just leave it like that and um, Because it's a very quick tutorial. Let's just leave it like that So I'm gonna head over to where that picture is click on it and then delete it Okay so I'm just trying to show you, let me show you some of those things. This is number one to ten. So I'll click on that picture. I'll click on where it says delete. I'll delete it. Then I will head over to the element and I will search for puppies. Because I want to use Poppy as my one, okay? Because my students love dogs, so I think they will love this when they see it. So I'm just going to remove that and put dog, one dog, one puppy, and I'm going to ensure that it aligns and it falls at the appropriate position. Can you see the num? Can you see that red line? It shows that it's fit in into the perfect position so that's how you make sure that it's perfectly aligned that it's in alignment with the page then i'll go ahead and also delete this airplane and um, replace it with two puppies replace it with two puppies you can also use whatever image you prefer you can use fruit if that is what you think you love or what your students would like you can also put that there okay so i'll change it to put two puppets then what do i have to do right now i have to duplicate it to get two puppets and if i want to keep doing puppets i'll just keep duplicating the one i already have here then try to resize it to make it smaller so that it won't be bigger than the page then um then ensure that it's also on the same line with the other one then i'll move to the top page so if i want to have if i want to make it um three puppies i'll do the same thing as well but if i don't want to i can change and put some um a different image okay so right now i'll just head over to elements again type in what i want excuse me type in the image i want then um, once I've typed in the image, I'm just going to replace whatever is there before with that image. So let's say, um, let's keep session, let's keep session. Let's say it's, uh, uh, it's rocket I love. I'm just going to click on that, then uh, duplicate it. No, it's more different. So I just delete this and duplicate this about three times three times get it so there are four rockets already so let's say i want three rockets i want four and then i have to duplicate that three times i duplicate it three times very quick then i will resize it so that it can fit perfectly into the space into the page provided 
okay so uh, i'll quickly do that and resize it properly so that one is not bigger than the other okay all right that's good so i'll move to the next page i'll change the change the bicycle to um three rockets i'll quickly do that so once i've done that Once I've done that, I'll move to the next one. So uh, now I have see so what I've got. I got one puppy. Then if I've, I'm done with that, I need to print it. I'll go to where it says download or where it says share now. I'll go to PDF print. Print best print. So that's a best print. So PDF print. Okay. So you click on it and. Um, gives you to go ahead to download it so that you can have the best content quality so you click on download and it's loading right now so let's say i've designed the 10 pages i'm just going to hit the download now and i'll start downloading it once i'm done downloading it it will appear like this so i can take it to print it press where i can print it and um, laminate it or print it into good cards and make it look good so i can actually use it in my classroom or sell it or do whatever i want with it right now i can also sell it on digital uh, market or digital store or i can go ahead print it out and start selling it i hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you do please don't forget to give me to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that when i once i drop wonderful video content like this you will be the first person to get notified and if you want me to do any video for you please drop it in the comment section so that i can know what you want me to do all right thank you for listening and thank you for watching this video